dum tadi dum tadi da 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 dum tadi da 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 dum da dum da 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 dum da 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 Easy to get confused. The sawmill. For obscure reasons, he has always refused to divulge. Phidias Sancropo's father left his native land of Arcadia to settle in the Wolvesvale region, becoming the operator of a sawmill for the W. Hood Company. Since then, Phidias has taken over for his father, but the infernal beasts have made life difficult for the Acadian. They've been specifically targeting his mill for some time now. All right, this is another location we have to defend. of damage last night, so I'd gone down to the hardware store in the village to get stuff to fix my mill. I was coming back, and since I didn't have any more tobacco in my pouch, I said to myself, it'd be a good idea to warm myself up a little at Jackie's. Say, Phidias, could there be something here that's attracting the beast? Except for my cabin, my barn, there's just your mill. But the attacks keep getting worse night after night. You're not hiding anything from us. Are you, friend? Of course he is. Me? Hiding something? As I live and breathe. In fact, if there's something I would have liked, it would have been for you to help me defend my mill last night. The lumberjacks from W. Hood Company came to take away the downed tree that was blocking the main road. So you can easily get to the mill now. And then, if you help me, I'll help you back putting out your traps. With the three of us, it'll go faster. Sounds like a good deal to me. You can count on us tonight. We'll protect your mill. Yeah, that's actually a terrible deal. <laughs> he needs to defend his own place. It gets pretty com uh, complicated to defend a bunch of places at once. The W. Hood Company. So, I could play the tutorial. I've been told that nobody wants to see it, though. <laughs> the spike trap. All right, I am just going to get in here and defend the mill. I have to set some, you know, traps up for the night and so forth. The miller's help gives you additional action points. That's these down here. But if the mill is destroyed, you fail the night. Okay. So, if you want to see the tutorials, let me know. Otherwise, I'm going to cut them out and just focus on gameplay. Wolf. Uh, so we have two waves. We have some big wolves, the grand wolves. Two of them. We have one werewolf, and we have two little tiny wolves. So, I have to prioritize. This is the mill over here where Phidias lives. This is my house. If any of the buildings get taken out, then of course, we lose the night. So that's wave one, wave two. Uh-oh, here they're attacking the barn, barn, house, the mill. That's not so bad. And what do we have? We have the wolf trap, which is basically a hunting trap, the hanging net, a bonfire, bait, and the spike trap. Now for the spike trap, you basically need to get several creatures, three or more, standing on top of the spike trap, and then it will be triggered. So, you know, the spikes actually look like they pop out of the ground. Um, or you could think of it as they, the wolves fall into a pit, whatever. Wave one, let's take care of this first. I don't think I'm going to have a lot of trouble with these two little wolves. In fact, I don't know that I'll put traps down for them. Now, this werewolf is a different story. He's going to need to be a little bit hurt, at least. And during this round, I'm going to have to knock out these guys and then run up here. So I don't want them hurting the mill in the meantime. I'm going to put down some bait. Uh, I don't know. It just costs action points to put down bait. Let me see. These instantly kill wolves and grand wolves, so I actually might go ahead and take care of both of these grand wolves with those spike traps. And that'll actually allow me to remove the bait that I put here. So one wolf dead, one wolf dead. Easy. And while I'm doing this, I wonder if I'm going to have enough uh, money to just kill them all off with spike traps. 
or with the with the um, wolf trap rather. This isn't going to kill the werewolf all by itself, but it'll help. And he's going to be slowed down pretty substantially right here. Let's see. Maybe I move the bait so that it's a little bit easier for him to get to on his path. Hello. Where you go? Oh, okay. Okay. I had the wrong thing selected. So the plan is, he comes out, he eats some bait, he runs across one trap, eats another bait, then attacks the house. These guys, they just run to the house and die. These guys are going to get hit with my axe right here, and then I'm going to run over to the mill and try to take out this werewolf before he causes more problems. I'll add more traps, though, if I think I'm all right for the second round. For this round, we've got two wolves. You know, I would love to just destroy them. That's a pain. They're going to run along that little line, though. Thanks to Josie's omens, we know exactly their path. These guys are going to do the same thing. So maybe I want to put two more traps just along that path. Okay. Slowly running out of options here, but it'll be fine. Um, and then him. What's he going to do? So this guy is probably going to be one that I will fight because I'm going to be over here anyway, right? So I'm going to start a bonfire. I will fight him with a bonfire, um, you know, to help keep me safe. And then this guy's the one that we haven't done anything for. One werewolf. Um, we have a little bit of money. Why don't I mostly focus on these bait traps, though? I'm going to slow him down as much as I can. I'm going to put one wolf trap under there since we have a little bit extra money. Let me see. It's possible that I can keep him there long enough to use a net trap, but I'm not sure. We'll find out. You know... Oh, uh, it's going to be tricky to run all the way from here, all the way over, after fighting off a werewolf. <laughs> Let's save the net trap for the guy over on the other side, then. Boop. All right. You. I wonder if I can put something right there. Yes, perfect. All right, so this is for werewolf round two. And, um, I just want one bait to put under there so that he will stop for a second. Okay, this will be it. I'm not going to go to town tonight. I think we've got these guys pretty well covered, and I'm basically out of money. So. <laughs> See, if I had any extra action points, I would cut wood for the lumber company, the W. Hood Lumber Company, in exchange for money. That's very helpful, but mm, no action points left tonight. Let's see. Eau de vie, beer, caribou. I hope it's all right because I do not have any money. I do have a skill point. All right. Wolf trap now inflict 10 points of damage to werewolves and grand werewolves. So that's great. I've got a trap out there for a, a werewolf. Let's start. Almost out of ammo. Do you want to continue? No, what do I need? Oh, I don't have any holy bullets. I have four regular bullets. Oh, but I don't have any money. Let's go ahead and see how this plays out. I might have to redo. It's a cold, dark night. And I am surrounded by werewolves. Enraged. Certain enemies have a chance of turning enraged the more you attack them. Right, I think that we're skipping the tutorial. Once an enemy though. is enraged, it's much more aggressive. And it Although I really like them, I think they're very well done tutorials. Again, just let me know if you can. We're waiting for Dos Wolfie. Here they are. I can take them out with no problem. Yeah. No problem. I'm going to run over here. 
there's going to be more to do. I wish I had a little bit of stamina. I think that uh, Joe O'Carroll had a lot more stamina. It feels that way anyway. Okay, that guy's eating. I wish I had some blessed bullets, but didn't have the cent 10 cents. <laughs> Alright, what are you doing? Um, I wonder if I can go around. He's gonna smell me at me. Oh. Okay, yeah, that wasn't good. That wasn't good. He definitely smelled me. But it's okay. Let me go this way. And he's being held in a wolf trap. Oh, he hit me. Let's get over here and light this fire. Okay. Now I'll just shoot him intuitively. I think a couple of times. I just need one bullet left over for the net trap. Otherwise, I'm gonna... oh no, I missed his head. <sighs> All right, let's attack. <laughs> Uh, that was, that was, uh, fail. That was fail. Come here! Yes! Yes! Okay. And I know he's resistant, but he's not totally resistant to regular bullets. So he's dead. Good! That was round one. Without a hitch. Well, got hurt a little bit. Not terrible hitches, though. Round two. We've got some guys coming over from the west, or the east rather. We've got them coming over from everywhere. I'm going to defend the mill until this werewolf comes down though. And, oh no, the other werewolf. I didn't even think about that. That other werewolf ate the bait intended for this one. Yes, okay. Alright, alright, good. We got him, we got him. Love the falling rock trap. It does a lot of damage. Ah, oh no, no. Okay, they're just chomping on bait. It's going to be fine. I'm going to get there in time. Save my sister Josie. My brother Joe O'Carroll, who is staying inside the house for no apparent reason. And should be out helping. And you know, Phidias. Though he's getting all of this help from us. Inside tonight. He worked all day and he's inside all night. But, uh... I worked all day, too. Let's see. We have no bullets left, so this is going to be all axe work. Hello. Oh, no. I was thinking it was a little wolf. It's a big werewolf. Oh, no, no. All right. All right. He's dead. He's dead. No worries. <laughs> Good. The night is saved. Survive, we won. Survive the night. We win. None of our buildings got hurt. I am level 5, and we get the wax seal of success. Excellent. Well, I will catch you for the next installment of Let's Play Song for Our Tales of Werewolves. Pretty fun game, and as you can see, we've got some crazy enemies coming up. See you soon. <laughs>